can't tell you how touched I am that you take the time to come on the Humagoo and spend some laughs Aww. with me. And, you it's know. my pleasure. Absolutely my pleasure. We had such a good time talking before, and, and uh, you know, you're so fun, and yeah, I enjoy it. I appreciate you having me on. It's great, Carmen. Let's talk a little bit about Fred, Fred Halster. You, is, yeah. How, how, did I pronounce that right, Fred Halster? Hostetler. Hostetler. He is just, I love him. He's got great karma, yeah. sends it, send it my way on yep. the show. And the minute I got yeah, done with you last time, he you know hit me up right away. Isn't she fabulous? And I, and I, and I always thought about him and, and Doug and all that great stuff that they send my way. Um, yeah. You know, he does, he's got a lot going on, too. Besides he yes, works with he you, he's got his, um, I think it's, I forget, The Taming of the Wolf it might be. He's got his own CD that he does, too. Yeah, he's, he's gotten very tech savvy. I'm very impressed with, with him. Uh, you know, I really rely on him for, for, you know, it was his idea for bringing out this the technology, for, for understanding, you know, yes. how to get these things out there. Because really, that is absolutely not my thing at all. You know, I can hook up your TV and all your components, but I cannot think be in into the uh, great wide open like that. But he does. He's a great planner. Um, and, of course, he's, you know, a really, really excellent person and really, you know, you know, we were married, right? No, no, For I like did not know 20 that. Years. No. Yeah, we, oh, we, we were we were. We were together for twenty years, <laughs> and I and so you can imagine how how wonderful it is that we are still working together. Oh, um, wow. yeah! After another period of time in in separate and and um, combined elements, you know. So he's a great guy, and um, yeah, what can I say? I mean, I could go on and on. He's Fred's a very, very, very good person. And super smart person and very kind. Again, that was neat. I mean, he texted me just a couple <laughs> seconds almost laugh. to got off the show, and it was so cool he's that gonna he was laugh. listening. You know, and uh, yeah. speak, yeah. speaking he's, of that. He's listening. Oh, sorry, Fred. It sounds like the Sammy Modlin show. That's what he's talking <laughs> <laughs> Sammy Modlin. Oh, well, what am I supposed to say? You know, he's great, and he's got a, a, a great imagination, a musical imagination, and yeah. We're still doing things together. We're working on a project right now. We're working on a tune right now. I just sent him weird things. He says, just send me the vocal. I said, what? <laughs> just the vocal? So he's going to fly in, put in my vocal into the tune, <laughs> and then he's going to get the drummer and the bass player. Oh, gosh. Like, okay, really? Yeah. Well, you want me to send the backgrounds, too? So I sent the backgrounds. <laughs> anyway. That's putting a little it's stew cool. together. It's weird music. how things happen today. Yeah, a stew. We're making. He's making a stew. <laughs> well, I have new toe frog. <laughs> that brings us to the LA Critics Awards, and Doug sent me that today. Both of you are on the LA Critics Awards oh, yeah. for for this year, for the first half of the that year. Was, Blue by Nature's up that there, was and surprising. Yeah. And he's up there for video. I I thought he was on there for for another thing too. Oh, was I it for video? Uh, I think Doug I now for best video. Else. Just, it might be something else too, but it's right up there. The LA Critics just came out. There's a whole bunch of I Gulf Coast artists on there. Diana Rain and Tony Campanella and people right. I've talked to. Right. Like Vin Mott right. and uh, D. Miller right. and other people. I mean, it's just amazing and really cool. And that just came out. I know, like Gulf Coast, if you're listening, <laughs> I am really near you. <laughs> hey, Gulf. Hey, Mike. Zito, I met you at the Sioux Falls Jazz Fest. You, you thought I was crazy. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, they. they I'm go- not. <laughs> <laughs> they love that, you know, the the karma of love of life and food. That's so cool, man. I'll tell you what. Let's get to a track right now. Fun and games with. Fun. Oh, love this tune. We'll Great right song. Back. Thank you. Uh, if I may say so myself. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. We'll be right back. Fun and games. You don't. Love me like I love you. Why do you let me go mm-hmm. and play the fool? Why do you hold me and kiss me like you do? 
things Just fun and games Fabulous, Karen Lawrence. Hey, Karen, I'm on cue this time. The song ended and I said hello. Isn't that amazing? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Last time the song ended, I'm like, Karen, hold on, we got to talk real fast. It's over. Let's go. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> oh my God, the fabulous Karen Lawrence is my great guest. Uh, Blue by Nature. Hey. CD it's is up for fabulous. LA Critic Awards. Uh, Fred awesome. is up there, and so many of the Gulf Coast were awesome records or artists on there, and uh, big stuff going on. And uh, mm-hmm. let's talk about some of the tunes that we got here. It's been so long off of the Blue by Nature CD. Tell us a little story about that. We were talking some on that. This song is pretty funny, and I I, I listened to it on this Best of Live release, and it really brought back all the. Uh, the history of the song where we only had about 20 minutes of material mm-hmm. and when we first started out so i was just 
squeezing songs out. I think I was taking, a, I was working in offices, a temp, and I was taking a lunch break, and I was kind of downtown L.A., and I'm walking, and I start writing this song, and I took it to the band right away. And we played mm -hmm. in some little dive, and it was a train wreck. Oh, it was embarrassing. Oh, my God, it was, it was horrible. It was, and, and once you're in a song, you, you just can't stop, you know, like, okay, let's go, hit the one chord and let's just end it. You know, people are looking at you. You're trying to make something out of it. And it was just awful. I'm leading them with finger codes, like first chord, second chord, bridge. We had, even at that stage had like, okay, one, four, five. Anyway, but it was awful. And over about a year of playing it and fun and games the same way. Yeah. Uh, which is the song you just played. Um, the same kind of thing. I called the song. Oh, no, don't you do it. Don't you do it. And I called the song. And we, so back to uh, Been So Long. The song turned into like a 20-minute song. I'm not kidding. It was edited on this, this, this thing you're about to play. Is edited. I think it's an 11-minute song on our live album. And Rick Dufay just rips it on it. He is just wow. just a pleasure to hear. I just love it. I mean, no wonder we no wonder the song was so long on stage. It was just wonderful. It was just a wonderful groove and yeah, it was very sexy and um I just I don't know. I I love the tune. I have a hard time playing it and singing it at the same time. Like when I'm playing guitar. Yeah. For some reason. <laughs> I don't know. I'm particular about, you know, the little hits and stuff, but um it, and it ain't as good <laughs> when I do it by myself as it is with the band. Well, the thing about the, C it. the thing about the CD is you're so much fun while you're singing it. You're so modest, and you know the the groove in the band and the energy and the team, and it comes off. And again, Blue by Nature is up for the LA Critics Award. So let's go to that right now. It's been so long. I know. Here we go. Thank you. Rock on. Mm-hmm. 